Yo, hey guys, welcome back to From the Depths. We're just taking a little stroll with uh, Scrappy right here on electric power. Check that out. And, uh, oh, looks like we're running out of power here. Uh, there it goes. That's interesting. So yes, electricity is a little weird in this game. I went ahead and replaced the gas engine just as a test to see how electricity works exactly. And uh, I found out it's pretty simple. All you need... Oh my gosh, let me cut the power. There we go. So it looks like all you need are just some batteries. So there's like the electric engine. You just plop right there. Uh, some batteries you can place around it. And some chargers. So all you gotta do to recharge it is to have a, uh, a ship with a gas engine of some sort to transfer the power from the uh, from the gas engine by burning fuel and all that. So there's really no like pure electric engine. But I'm going to show you how to recharge this right now. So we're pretty much out of power right there because I just I don't really put like a couple batteries on it. But if you want to recharge it, uh, you would either like you know dock that with the mothership or something like that. You would dock it with your your main ship, and then uh, and then have your main ship recharge it so your sh other smaller ships can go back out. Or uh, yeah, okay. So let's see here. All right, so I'm going to go ahead and tell this uh, scrappy dude to come on back. And and I have these two generators here, just kind of chilling out on the deck. I have them turned on. So pretty much, oh my gosh, where's he going? So pretty much when he gets close, they should start running. There we go. So he doesn't even need to be docked. So as soon as he's close enough, these generators will start running, gas engine running. And they are putting out power to charge this guy up. Yep. Yep, it's pretty simple. So he's just charging up. And the only thing I did was just this. It's so simple. So I went to, uh, let's see here, engines. Uh, because I know some of you were asking about this. And I just went to electric engine. And I just plopped down an electric engine on Scrappy Guy. And then I just placed a battery. And then I just put a battery charger. Pretty much like wherever the uh, the green ticks are. Something like that. Okay. Yeah, connected, connected. Oh, look, see, this guy's charging too now. <laughs> so you can just store a whole bunch of power if you want to, wherever you want. And when it's done charging, there it is. And these generators, all you gotta do is just um, go right here, say generator. And just plop it wherever you want to, uh, you know, charge your vehicles at. And then just press Q to turn it on. And boom, there you go. So that's really simple. Like, electric engines are extremely easy. And uh, I guess very handy if you have, like, a bunch of small attack craft. Like, light, small attack craft that, that don't need... You want to save some resources on, because I think this stuff's pretty cheap. Let's see, electric engine. Yeah, look how cheap that is. It's like... It's like this a little tiny oil, metal, natural... This stuff's cheap. So this may be a good way to go after, uh, after you develop a good mothership. You just go ahead and put electric engines on everything. And then when stuff starts running low on power, just reclaim it back. Just say, come back and dock back. So, all right, I wanted to show you guys that. Because I thought it was really cool. And I know some of you wanted to check that out for a bit. All right. Welcome back to Sky Paradise now. We are just cruising around after our last win. Just enjoying the scenery, enjoying the mountains. They, they're very green. I like the green tops. Green tops are very good. Very good. So, order of business today, as you all shall, uh, should probably be guessing, is that we are going to take over the Steel Striders' main base. We're just going to head over, uh, let's see, a block over here, a block over here, and then we're, I'm going to gather our entire force and just bring the hammer down on the Steel, steel uh, Striders. Uh, oh yeah, we're gonna do it up real good. <laughs> it's gonna be awesome. We're probably gonna smash into pieces like uh, like a, a barge made of toffee or something. Yeah, we'll, we'll smash them good. So, but first we gotta make our way a little bit down there. Uh, let's see, do we have anyone attacking us right now? No, these guys are still up. Oh, yeah, reinforcing. You can reinforce all you want, dudes. I'm cool with that. We could probably smash up a level 500 if we wanted to right now. Maybe not. <laughs> Maybe that's like... Uh, anticipating a little too much, but yeah, it looks like these guys are super safe. They got a small safe little corner here this uh, Scarlet Dawn, so that's cool. Got the little place there. These green guys are just hanging out, being green as they uh, as they always are. And uh, and we're being green too. Look at this awesome stuff. Oh yeah, we still need to build a little uh, fortress right here just to get this metal. Nah, but I'll do that later. It's not like we really need metal right now. So okay, so I'm gonna go ahead, move over here, and let's do it up. I'm going to call the whole fleet once we get to their home base. But for now, I think this is good, just mopping up some stuff here and there. Oh yeah, there's not really much going on in this area right next to us. Uh, we got this little... Oh, this cool dude. Look look how cool he looks. He's just like... He's like, yeah. Oh, he just <laughs> luckily missed that whole hail of bullets. Look at that. <laughs> it's like one of those times where you're just like dumb luck. You're just like, oh, I'm spinning out of control. And there's like murder right next to you. 
on your doorstep. It's just like murder, 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 murder. Nope, missing it, missing it. Maybe we'll get lucky and like some stray shots will go blow up one of these guys, huh? So I guess we have to wait for our missiles to go ahead and clean this this guy up. He's, he's shooting missiles just like. <laughs> oh, you know what? This is actually a good tactic to like throw our uh, throw our mothership off. It's just like have a spinning plane like this, and uh, all our shots get wasted. But once our frag planes come and they uh, start shooting off all their missiles, it's going to be pretty bad. You don't want this thing to get close to anything. Oh, cool! We actually got a battleship. Sweet. Let's let's take a look at this fight from his uh, point of view. This will be cool. Oh gosh, the planes are starting to launch their. Uh, oh, we got one of our, one of our uh, docking stations. Are, uh, oh, he just got messed up. <laughs> messed up real good. I can't wait to take on their base. This is the end of you guys. I hope you guys realize this. You may have some um, strong places in the world here and there, but uh, not for very long. Once we take out their base, they can't send reinforcements, and that's pretty much game over. Loving it. Oh man, we're gonna cut him up real good. Oh, what happened to your gun? Your gun got a little messed up. You got a little tiny barrel and a big barrel. That's so funny. That uh, guy's blowing up. Okay, we all know what's going to happen here. Let's move on to the next area. Okay, so we are in the next area over. Looking for another fight. There's another, uh, let's see, five enemies here. Let's go ahead and release our uh, bombers and see how they, uh, how they do. Because we got the resources now to just go ahead and, like, I guess, waste if they smash into each other. So I'm going to go ahead and release them, like, a little at a time. And let's see how they do. Let's see if we can learn uh, some good tactics with the bombers here. All right, so release them, release them, yeah. Good, we start shooting already. Cool. So that should give them all enough space between each other. They're going about being bad. I mean, hopefully there's going to be something left. All right, so cool, cool. We got bombers flying around. I love these things, man. Oh, gosh, I just love planes. Really want to make, like, a battleship version of, a, like, a spaceship kind of... I don't know. We'll, we'll see. I don't want to make any promises right now. But uh, eventually we'll get like some crazy ridiculous uh faster ship than the mothership that uh has huge cannons on it like really huge cannons like maybe just one ginormous cannon on like some uh -oh, on some ginormous battleship oh this guy's good yeah look at him he's like a tank he's like oh i got that no problem going down for a dive boom oh some of his missiles got busted up oh he's gonna get busted up he's going against the battleship here he goes Oh, that guy's going to get... Hey! Oh, that missile... That missile got shot by something. Got, like, intercepted by some bullets. Oh, they're, like... Oh, they're, like, changing targets and stuff. They're, like, not doing a very good job. They were, like, going for those guys, and then they saw this guy on their radar, and they're like, oh, let's go ahead and shoot him. And then the missiles have to adjust. Interesting. Okay. Well, let's see. Let's get a hit. Get a hit. No! Oh... Oh, a bunch of big old letdown. But at least they didn't blow up. And it looks like... Wait a second. <gasps> I think we're getting attacked. 590 seconds attack on resource zone in high... Uh-oh, 4-4. This is cool. We're actually getting attacked by... Oh. These suckers, look at them. They're like, oh, we're gonna, we're gonna smash you up. And look at these guys. They're going around here trying to pillage our 8-4. Okay. I see how it is. Oh my gosh, we're gonna mop the floor with these guys. I am not gonna I'm not gonna put up with this crap. These guys think they're so tough. Alright, so we are officially at war with three factions now. Three factions are attacking us. Soon to be two though, once we take out the home base this episode. Oh I can't wait. Can't wait. Oh here we go. Got some more missiles fire. Let's see if they hit their target. They should. Yeah, I'll call that a hit. <laughs> Alright, sweet. So I guess we're gonna have to go and defend this little dinky uh, this little dinky place here. These guys are going to get wrecked. And we haven't even fought these guys before, so this will be cool. We'll see if they have any new ships. Okay, Great Talons. What you got? Seven enemies. Wow. I wonder what they, uh, I wonder what they got. What they got going here. They're very interesting. Maybe it's just a bunch of, like, tiny ships. I don't know. Let's see. Let's get the, uh, let's get the old binoculars out. What do we have? What do we have? Oh, that looks like a, like a A-10 Thunderbolt. What else do we have? Oh, dude, he got some cool little... Scouting ships around there. This guy looks actually pretty mean. That's a pretty mean looking ship. Kind of scared. Let me take a look at this map again. Uh, yeah, it's just them. Maybe there's two groups of them or something. And, uh, and they're just like overlapping one another. They like snuck up on us. Got some ships over there. It doesn't look too bad. He looks, looks like we're going to demolish his plane because he doesn't look very nimble. Let's get a good look at this guy here. Okay. So, it looks like he is, uh, oh, he's got some cool... Little seeking missiles. Uh, <laughs> oh, 
uh, he's got some cool, oh, he's got some nice colors and paint jobs. And, yeah. Oh, yeah. He's taking a hit. Oh, there he goes. <laughs> Once you get hit, you just can't stop getting hit. That's how it is. Once you pop, you can't stop. Just keep popping. So he popped all the way till he, he popped his head off. That's about it. Well, good job, sir. Good job. Uh, you almost got to us. And you got some cool little, like, yeah, like little symbols and stuff on you. It's pink. I like the pink. That's pretty funny. So what, what do these ships look like over here? Before we get to them and just, like, wreck their faces. All right, so we got our mother ship coming. What do we have here? Don't want to take too long in this. Definitely want to get this uh, base assault going on. Oh, that's pretty cool. Oh, they're like anti-air too. This is like this is like our best enemy right here. It's like they've got the answer. What is that? It looks like looks like a steel strider guy. That's pretty cool. So they have like anti-air, and then they got like really good like melee things. All right, so what's this? What's this like over here? Are they like? Are they like even getting us with these bullets? Oh yeah, they're doing good job. They're doing work. They're like hurting us and stuff, maybe? Maybe? Actually, it looks like their bullets are just bouncing off of us. <laughs> because they don't have any... Oh yeah, they have armor piercing, yeah. Looks like they're pretty much missing. Oh, they got some... Uh, they're doing some damage, maybe? Oh! I don't think they're doing damage fast enough because it sounds like they're exploding. Yeah. <laughs> oh man, this is great. This is great. But yeah, so I have no idea what to expect for the Steel Striders home base. I'm not going to take a peek even before I do recording. I'm going to do it uh, first time surprise for me as it is going to be for you guys. So I'm just going to bring everything I can just like in real war. Like, you know, this is uh, this is like everything on the line here. We could lose our mothership if we're not, if we don't have it all uh, planned out right. We might have to retreat or something like the first time with the first uh, deep water guard base. So we'll see. We'll, we'll all be shocked together. We'll see what kind of madness they're going to come up with. Hopefully... I don't know, maybe we'll have to add some shields onto our mothership too. Maybe like to defend the block. Well, I think this is going to be further back. So I guess we'll deploy hurricanes in front like last time. And then mothership will come in uh, after everyone else. Uh, we'll see. We'll see. We'll see what's going to happen. I'm, it's going to be... Uh, I guess we're going to do that next. Alright, let's do it. Let's cut right to it. I'm going to bring everybody to the fight. Right over... Yeah, right over here. We can do it. Alright. Just going ahead too and intercepting these uh, these crazy fools, uh, these uh, what do you call it? the twin guard that we're going to our uh, to our base. Yeah, going ahead and just clean these guys up, mop them off the map, and I think we should be clear and good for the final assault. Man, these guys are really aggravating me. Urgh. Looks like this is the last of their attacks for a while. So finally, we should get some peace from these guys. They should be learning the lesson not to be attacking us. Oh, these guys are Scarlet Dawn! Oh, I didn't even realize that. Wait, there's a fight going on. What's going on here? <laughs> yeah, we actually smashed into that mountain when we first spawned in. Look how high these mountains are. They're like, like 500 things tall. So, yeah, so you never know. You might just smash into a mountain when you first start. But that's okay. It wasn't a big deal. We, uh, we pulled through, repaired, it took off, and yeah, it wasn't, wasn't so bad. And I think all our guns are working now. Yeah, they're all working. We repaired up. Got enough repair bots on there. Look, they're all like flying back here. They're like, hey, wait up, mother ship, miss mother ship. Let's, let's, uh, I want to dock back on you, yeah. So, cool. All right, so this fight's over. All right, so I'm going to go ahead, head back to base, and assemble the fleet, put our heads together, think about uh, any kind of tactics we may uh, apply or use in the upcoming siege. And yeah, and then we're going to take it right to them. Ah, it's so good to be home finally. Ah, we haven't been home in a while. We've just been going around. Blowing everyone up, just clearing out the map, doing some serious work. But now, we are back home at peace, uh, for the time being, figuring out our battle plan. Uh, yep, like I said before, I think the hurricanes are going to be on the front. Let me go ahead and turn their shields on now. Someone did uh, recommend to me that I could use uh, some kind of control panel to turn these things on. Uh, I, I may do that later. I may add a control panel to these uh, hurricanes so I can just turn the shields on and off from like an easy location, probably not having to go to the build mode uh, to get to it, but yeah, I may do that. I mean, this isn't really so big of a deal. It's not really that hard to do. So to make sure the shields are on though before we get there. All right, so reflect, reflect, reflect. Yes, everyone's reflecting. These guys, oh man, they're so boss. Ooh, oh, that's so cool. Look at that base just flying around. It's just like flying around like it owns the place. Okay, so enough dilly-dallying. I will put the formation together. And we are going to <laughs> hopefully, hopefully, uh, take them over. Okay, so here's the battle plan. 
Three Hurricanes in the front, Midnight in the middle, three Terminados in the back, and then a whole line. I just, I just pray that, uh, that there's no mountains. We're not going to end up in the mountains here. But yeah, I got the uh, longbow in the center in the reserves, and we got our planes, the clouds, ready to attach. Uh, as soon as, as soon as everyone comes on the field, they should automatically attach to the longbow, and then I can send them out uh, and do their, do their work. So we're going to have a lot of flying targets, a lot of ground targets, all types of distractions for, uh, for the enemy cannons to be focusing on. And hopefully there will be enough distractions where everything will live and we will pound them, pound them into the, uh, into the earth, into the deep, deep seas. So this is the plan. Let's see if it works. Uh, and the results of this are going to be the results that we are going to live with. Uh, if we get smashed to uh, oblivion and we have nothing left, then, uh, then that's, that's where we'll be. I'm not going to reload the game. I'm going to go ahead and <laughs> continue on and, uh, and be forced to come up with better ways to build better ships if, uh, if everything dies. So this will be fun. This will be fun. Just rolling the dice. Okay, so I'm on the longbow, chilling out. Cool, looks like we're not smashing into the mountains right off the bat. Where the heck are our ships at? Okay, so our ships are way over here. Oh, this is so exciting. So it looks like they're all moving into position. Longbow, it looks like those planes are attaching. Good, good, good. I may, I may go ahead and unattach them once we clear this mountain. All right, ships are doing what they do best. Look at that great formation. They're just like, doesn't look like we're getting shot yet. Okay, the shots are coming in. So we got the hurricanes. Oh, let me just stabilize the camera here. All right, so the hurricanes are moving up. What are we, what are we dealing with here? Oh, that's a scary sight. Hopefully we'll clear that. Yeah, it looks like we're gonna clear that mountain. All right, the mothership that is. <laughs> So it looks like we have a similar base as to the last time. Okay, I can live with that. That's fine. I mean, we whittled down their forces all around themselves. This actually looks smaller. No, it looks about the same. They got like a cool little tower here for something. Yeah, okay. So let's rush on back. Shooting their explosive rounds. I think we got this in the bag, honestly. Feeling pretty good about this. Let's go ahead and maybe set our flyers free. Well, last time we set them free, they were, um, they got pretty demolished pretty quick. So maybe I'll still let the Hurricanes take the damage. Looks like this guy was getting hit right over here. Hurricane number one. So he's getting pretty wrecked. But he's alive. Oh, look at this shrapnel and stuff just kind of bouncing off of him. Yeah, there we go. Oh, yeah, see? Shots bouncing off. I love it. All right, so it looks like they're targeting this guy now. As long as they keep going straight that way, it should be fine. They're targeting this guy again. Bouncing off. Oh, I love that shield. Oh, it's so worth it. All that shrapnel just like getting repelled. Mothership's coming up. No one's shooting yet. No one's within range. But we are, uh, oh man, we're moving up. This is going to be ridiculous when we start opening fire. I think I'm going to go ahead and release the hounds, aka the, uh, the planes, the jets. Uh, release dock. I'm going to do them slowly, a little at a time here. Release dock. And uh, maybe they won't smash their, themselves in. Release dock. And the last one. Really stock. Okay, yeah! Oh, this is awesome. <laughs> no one's shooting yet. I can't believe it. Yeah, they start you back there on purpose, I guess, because you can't really, like, sneak up. This guy's gonna be wrecked. He's already, like, yeah, he's kind of missing some pieces. Well, it looks like his cannons are still intact. Even his barrels are intact. Ooh, that didn't... that wasn't very good. So the planes are coming in. Oh, this is gonna be sick. Hope you guys know this is an enemy, right? How okay, good. Terminatus is shooting. Hurricanes are shooting. Oh, yeah, it's game on now. It's game on. Look at that formation, the flying uh, Z. <laughs> and we got like a oh, bomber after line of bomber coming in, rolling up. Oh, see, looks like they are shooting at the bombers now. This is the biggest threat. Oh, it looks like our mothership is starting to shoot. Oh, this is going to be crazy. So our bombers are coming in for an attack run. We got our hurricanes. Looks like our, our main fleet is attacking now. They're all choosing this little area here, probably because there's some kind of... Uh, Ammo barrels. Yep, there we go. It looks like an ammo barrel area. Look at those bullets coming in. <laughs> oh my gosh, where are they flying to? Oh, they're just kind of missing maybe a little. Yeah, that's alright. They'll adjust. What are a bomber is going to choose to shoot at? Okay, so they're launching eight missiles at this little... Oh, it looks like a brain spot. I see a little tran transmitter. Boom! Yeah, fragged up. Welcome to Frag Nation, where we sell frags to your face. Oh my gosh. <laughs> Woo! Okay. Alright, well whatever this was, it's gone now. <laughs> oh man, did we win already? Did we like just... Oh look, they got a rocket! They got a rocket, very good. Very good, they got rockets. Uh oh. Yeah, I'm not worried about that. 
So we have an absolute murderous hail. I'm gonna go ahead to uh, binoculars mode here. Let's see. Let's see what we're. Oh my gosh! <laughs> Whoa! No way! I feel bad for you, son. That is some terrible, terrible stuff to be happening to you. <laughs> wow! That is so cool. All right, let me turn his binoculars off here. Ah! I want to get binoculars off. I want to see the action. Things are starting to slow down a little bit here. Okay. Yeah, 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 yeah. Wow. Well, it looks like we had nothing to worry about. It looks like we are totally being... Oh, everyone's just shooting. Oh, we got, like, a whole cavalry now. Just taking out these towers. Just like... I mean, all their ammo supply has been blown up on this corner. The brain over here in the front has been blown up. Uh, something right now is blowing up. I don't even know what. Looks like, uh... It just, it just looks like we're just, we're just, uh... Oh, I can't wait to see this engine explode. Look at all that nice shiny glass up there just waiting to be, uh... Waiting to be destroyed and cracked up. This missile launcher isn't even shooting anymore. Oh, here we go! <laughs> now it's really not shooting anymore. Oh, look at it, look at it. Oh, oh this is fantastic. Where are bombers? Oh, here they come. Whoa, what's blowing up over there? Oh, they ran into each other. What a bunch of idiots. All right. Got to figure out some better AI. You know what I think I might do? I might set our bombers to fly at uh, at each at different altitudes. Have different bombing runs at different altitudes. And I think that'll prevent that kind of nonsense. Look at that. All, all three of them. Shh, whatever, man. Whatever. I guess I can go ahead and tell them to dock to the mothership. Or I can just kind of leave them there out of the fight. That's cool with me. All right. So mothership's really coming in here. The uh, Sky Paradise is making her main attack run. I mean, this is just domination at its finest. This is our finest hour, gentlemen. Where the base of the Steel Striders is going to put... Look at all the shots. They're going, they're going right for this right here, this core. What's this? Is this like a main engine area? Looks like some kind of, uh, something very important, yes. Something very important. Oh, looks like they're switching targets. Look how close we're getting. I hope we're not gonna collide. <laughs> I, s I told them to start pulling up at 70 feet. So cruising altitude of 225, I think, for the mothership, and then pull up at 70 feet. Yeah, there we go. Okay, nice. So we're not going to smash into anything. Oh, looks like we're taking... Oh, there we go. Just like that. Just like that. It, it just happens. We did it! Yeah! That was way too easy. Way too easy. Look at all those missiles just chilling. They're like, oh, we want to blow something up. All right. Oh, no. What the heck? What in blazes? Why are we going down? What the heck happened? I'm curious what happened to our ship. <gasps> what? What blew up our engine? What? I gotta check the tapes on that. Something something hit us. I bet you it was that guy. He's like, <laughs> hey, steal the show, huh? Yeah, I'll blow you up. I bet you it was this freaking guy right here. Or stupid guy. Darn it. <laughs> well, it looks like it was a successful battle. We beat him up pretty good, but unfortunately, our mothership is taking water. Let me get out of here. Let me let me take a peek around here. Take a look at the damages as I repair them with my tail. So, what do we have here? We have like a hole. We have a big hole right here. Oh, our ammo barrels got hit. Is that, this is where I keep them. Yeah, like right next to uh, <laughs> such critical uh, spots. So, something fragged our ammo barrels. I don't know what that was. Maybe it was like that one lone rocket? Yeah, see, it was this side. I mean, I thought I had them pretty well protected. I mean, there's a little gap right here. So maybe like a stray bullet just like landed on the barrel and just blew the whole thing up. I don't know. But definitely something to improve for the future. Uh, but we have like a, a gemongous amount of resources right now. Like 300,000 metal. So I think we're going to be okay. I don't think we have anything to worry about. Could probably build like two more motherships if we wanted to. So yeah, I mean... Uh, this is gonna get pretty great crazy guys. Get this water out of here. Somebody mop this up. This is ridiculous. Come on. I'm trying to run a tight ship around here. But okay guys, so thanks for watching. And next time we will. What are we gonna do next time? Let's see here. So we're all the way over here in this place. Got a bunch of allies. We, we, got a, we have a ton of enemies. Uh, I may go ahead and clean up these territories real quick, or we'll see. Maybe I'll have a new ship, maybe like a battleship, something fast and something extremely destructive just to go ahead and mop up easy territories. I think, I think that'll be a good plan of action. Something to get a quick job done and to really... Uh, oh, look, we're taking off again. Okay. 
So yes, look forward to maybe uh, a battleship, possibly a flying battleship. I would really like to have one of those with like a few really huge cannons. Uh, so yeah, so I'll see you guys next time. Bye-bye.